So uh, these days we are uh, launching the first uh, version, working version, which acts like uh, an analytical search engine, which allows search over different types of incidents, uh, pretty much in uh, real time, along with the statistics. Uh, so we are, we are searching for the past and the present of AI incidents. For the future, we would like to extend the functionality also that we would uh, allow prediction what kind of incidents might happen in the future and also to predict or estimate consequences of the existing uh, AI incidents uh, which may affect life or different stakeholders in the future. So the way how we uh, constructed AI incident monitor, we took as a baseline a platform for global media monitoring, right? Which roughly ingests a million articles per day. Out of this, we elicit down to the uh, roughly 15,000 AI related articles per day. And out of this, we uh, extract incident uh, related articles, which is in the range of maybe 100 articles per day, which uh, then when we compress them, this uh, brings down uh, roughly 20 incidents per day. As AI is evolving uh, really fast and now we in 2023 we are in a period where uh, several AI legislations are being formed including the risk framework uh, uh, and other parts of legislation it's good to understand what we are regulating and what we are trying to either constrain what kind of things we want to protect ourselves from. And this real-time uh, incident monitor brings us information what's actually happened, what kind of dangers and hazards are out there uh, in the world. Um, so uh, just to prevent disconnect from high-level um, legislation design on one side uh, and on the other side uh, what's happening in the reality. So most of the incidents are in um, this soft category, right? Where people are uh, getting insulted or <clears throat> there's some kind of bias and so on. There are way less uh, incidents on the side of uh, injuries or even deaths or physical harm, uh, which is a good news. It's also true that uh, physical harm didn't increase in the last year, while all other types of more like soft uh, incidents uh, increased uh, almost exponentially within 2023 with the appearance of uh, generative AI and uh, chat GPT. So the, the rate of incidents uh, is still increasing. Uh, at the moment uh, we are in the range of uh, around roughly 20, 20 incidents per day, but it may, it may uh, increase even more in the next, let's say, year or two. Yeah.